Welcome to the Smart Business Show episode, I don't know, something. I think 17, actually. Welcome to the Smart Business Show episode 17. Today, I want to talk about your dreams. Now, I generally like what I do. I like, and I find it interesting to program, um, to figure out complex problems like this, and to work on most of my client stuff, I find very interesting. There are always projects I have to take that... Um, maybe don't quite fit my ideal client. There's one or two things that are a little off on it. And sometimes you do have to do that. So I would never fault you for that. You need to feed your family. But what I really want to talk about today is your just your straight up dreams. So if you could design your life any way you want to and do what you want, what would that life look like? And as my wife and I have been looking at this and thinking about it more and more, um, I actually think that my ideal life probably would not be programming. It probably would be getting out more, getting out in the outdoors more, getting out hiking, um, all those different things, to getting my kids out there more. It would probably be writing reviews about gear, maybe, or um, just getting involved back in the outside more. When I think of if I had free time to do what I wanted, that is what I would want to do. I'd want to be going out. I'd want to be spending time on the river, in the mountains, wherever, getting out and enjoying this beautiful earth that we have. And that's really what I'd like to do. And so now the thing is designing my job and my income around that. And that is the biggest thing that I'm going to be embarking on over the next, hopefully just year or maybe less than that. We'll have to see. Maybe I can do this in just a year. Well, we will see. And so that's going to come down even to the client interactions that I am getting involved in now. I am going to be looking more at um, revenue share deals or percentage based where I get paid only if I help you make more sales. Because then if I don't show up for a week, I still make sales. They're my clients still make sales and I still make income. So that means I can not be inputting into this and I'm still getting stuff out of it, which is excellent. That's the big thing. And so by the end of this year, my main goal is actually to get 50% of my income entirely divorced from my uh, time in any fashion. So I don't have to show up and I still make 50% of what I would normally uh, expect. And that's going to be good because then the months when I'm really putting in a bunch of time, I'm making, say, you know, 150% in theory. Now, for you, though, I want to challenge it. with As we grow up, like you want to be a firefighter or an astronaut or something as a kid or whatever, some, something that seems crazy now when you think about it. But that doesn't mean that it really was crazy. It doesn't mean that you can't have that life you wanted. It just means you have to be intentional about it. Uh, you have to not let the people that are going to come around and be down or kind of be naysayers in your life uh, about this. You need to not worry about them. You need to... St- put together a plan and start to really execute it. Um, Yeah, so don't dare to dream and really work on executing that so that you can live the life that um, best suits you.